Hi folks, it's Frank, the Juice Press Man. I'm back to show you how to make a green juice. I haven't done this in a long time, and I think a lot of people are going to appreciate it. Okay, what I'm going to start off with is one green apple. I'm going to start off with about a little bit more than a quarter of a green pepper. I'm going to take some cilantro, about a half a bunch of cilantro, and I'm going to take a head of romaine lettuce. And what we're going to do is we're going to prep this up. Okay? I'm going to go ahead and just rip this right off the bottom here. I'm going to put this right in my little tank. Right. I'm going to go ahead and put some nice clean water in a BPA container. Nice filtered clean. Ooh, I love that. I'm going to put that in there. We're just going to whoosh, whoosh, whoosh it around. Get it life back up again. Colder the water, the better, too. Livens it up, and yes, it's going to soak up some water, but that's okay. It's going to make it crisper, and it's going to cut better, because if it's firmer, it'll cut better when we go to juice it. So don't you worry about that, because we're going to go ahead and drain and get a lot of this water right out of here. All right. We're not going to waste this water. We'll put it right in there. I find these at... Uh, Thrift shops all along. These are nice Tupperware spinners, salad spinners, whatever. They're really nice. Spin dry that. Alright, in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of do a little maneuver here. I'm going to put these in here. And the cilantro. Let's take the lettuce out. Everybody's got one of these. Take the lettuce out. There we go. There's our beautiful lettuce. Put that in there. This is not dirty water. We just washed our lettuce in. It's no big deal. But again, we want to take the cilantro. Wake it up. Hello! I'm going to wake all these guys up. Time to get juiced. Right on. Take that out of there. We are going to go ahead and get rid of this water now. Put this in here. Oh, that cilantro smells yummy. Alright, we're going to spin this. Until it says stop. Take this beautiful cilantro here. Oh, lay that right there. We'll take the apple. Do, 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 do. Take all this nice stuff out of here. Mm. Okay, I did weigh the romaine. It weighed less than a half pound. The apple was about right around uh, three quarters of a pound. I didn't weigh the pepper or the cilantro, but I figured it doesn't weigh that much. Alright, so here we got all that right here. Now let's go ahead and make, uh, well, let's just talk about the champion just super real quick. The reason why I like the champion is it's got a bunch of these little teeth in here. And these teeth go ahead and they just rip the vegetables and fruits over at a cellular, open at a cellular level. That allows us to go ahead and when we press it, to get enzymes and things that we'd never get any other way. And I love the champion because it's, so, it's just a powerhouse. It's really cool. So let's go ahead and just start pressing. Alright. Normally I'll start with an apple or a pepper. I hate it all that normal. Alright, let's just go ahead and put all the good stuff in here. There we go. A lot of people go, can the champion handle greens? It's like, yeah! No problem. Oh, when you start doing it, the smell. Oh, well the cilantro is beautiful. Just get a little piece of lettuce in there, just say we did. Alright. There we go. Get some lettuce. Yeah. There goes the lettuce.
little apple in there and we'll break it up a little. Just like to keep everything going nicely. It's not really that hard. And hopefully, you know, you'll be watching this video so you'll know how long it will take to actually make a juice. Which is a nice thing. Just going to get this lettuce in here. You know, need one piece of apple. There we go. Usually I feed it in a little slower, not that you have to, but I'm just that way. Right now I'm trying to speed juice. Because I got a couple people watching. Probably six, maybe five. I don't know if it's a good school night or if the Olympics are on. But anyway. Alright. Here we go. Finish line. Come on, get in there. Get in there. Stragglers. Right. Don't stick your fingers in there, okay? Don't do what I did. Okay, so now we got all the juice done. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop right here, and uh, if you come right back, we'll show you how to press it. Thank you.